Hey guys, welcome back. In this video, I am going to show you what the differences are between a grease pencil blank, a grease pencil stroke, even a grease pencil monkey, and there's a fourth one, the default grease pencil stroke, which is different. This default grease pencil stroke is different. Here we have a brand new scene, uh, a brand new 2D. In fact, I'll, I'll, I'll create another one. New 2D. Don't save this one. This is a brand new 2D grease pencil scene. And it's got a grease pencil stroke by default provided to you. Uh, and so let's start with this one. What is the deal with this one? This one, we're going to go ahead and, and uh, draw something on there. I'm just gonna get, get the pencil and I'm gonna draw something here. It says uh, uh, default grease pencil stroke. This is the default one. Uh, and in here, the thing is that when you create a brand new grease pencil scene, a 2D animation scene, you get this default grease pencil stroke. What does it have? It has uh, some materials provided already to you. It's got a solid stroke, which is what we just drew with. It's got the red stroke, which is a square stroke. It says right there, square stroke. In fact, I'm gonna bump this up to one. Uh, it's got the solid fill. It's a, it's a fill, not a stroke. And it's got the dot stroke, a, a black dot stroke. There it is. And then the solid black stroke. There it is. Those are your uh, four materials. One, two, three, four. And it's got two default layers already provided to you. The lines layer and the fills layer. Awesome. And so when we click out, I have a lot of questions. I lost all my uh, I lost all my my layers. I can't get the draw back on. Uh, this is a common question from beginners, and here is the answer: When you go to object mode and you deselect that stroke, uh, you can't get the. In fact, if you select something else, you cannot get that draw uh, mode back until you select the grease pencil stroke, either here in the outliner or out here in the scene and now it will be available to you guys okay to add a grease pencil stroke you have to be in object mode so let's go to object mode add and let's start with a grease pencil blank so obviously there's nothing in there but this is the grease pencil blank now we're working on it what happened uh, we don't have any materials, nothing. And we don't have any layers, nothing. There's no new, there's no layers. It is completely blank. It's called a grease pencil, G pencil. This is a grease pencil blank. It is a completely blank grease pencil object. Nothing, nothing is provided for you. So what happens if we go to draw mode and we start drawing? This is a grease pencil blank blank and, and again I drew this and, and it's at um, it's 100% of strength but there's no materials there's no materials uh, here in the material no materials uh, and here in the layers when we started to draw it created a grease pencil layer automatically that's the difference is the materials there's no materials here they provide and this is the default grease pencil stroke let's go ahead and add go back to object mode let's go to add grease pencil and let's go ahead and do a grease pencil stroke now this grease pencil stroke is different than the default grease pencil stroke how is it uh, uh, different well, it provides you with an, a graphic. It's not completely blank. It provides you with a graphic, a scribble. And let's go to the draw mode. And it provides you with 
these materials. We got a black material, a white material, a red, a green, blue, and a gray material. And this gray one is a fill. Let's let's look at those. Uh, the strength is at one, a hundred percent. I'll get the. Uh, this is a grease pencil stroke. And so this is the black material. Uh, the white material, obviously, you're not going to see it, but you can see it right there. Uh, the red, solid red. The green, solid green. The blue, solid blue. And then the gray is a fill. Uh, a fill with a stroke. And so that's our grease pencil stroke. It, pro it does provide you with all these materials and it provides you with two layers, one for the lines and one for the colors. Remember, the grease pencil stroke provided, oh, we have to go back to object mode to select this grease pencil stroke. And it provided you with two layers, the lines and the fills. This one's different. This one provides you lines and colors. It's the same, but it just named it differently. Plus it provided you with this um, squiggly thing. In fact, uh, we should go to edit mode, select this, and then just place it over here, just so that we know that this was um, the grease pencil stroke. A brand new, not the default, is a brand new grease pencil stroke. Now, the the other one is, let's go back to object mode, grease pencil monkey. Add a grease pencil monkey. And what is the difference? Let's move this monkey down. Let's move this monkey down. And let's call this, um, let's go to draw mode. And let's call this grease pencil monkey. Uh, and it's called a Zuzan. This, this monkey is called Zuzan. So if we go to the materials, you will see that it cre it provided the materials that it used for this illustration. The, the black outline, the skin color, the light um, outline, uh, the skin shadow, the eyes, the pupils, all of the materials it, it needed and it provided for you to draw this monkey. Uh, what about the layers? The layers are the, just the lines and the fills and they are properly um, separated all the lines are in the lines and all the fills are in the fills that is the difference between all of these grease pencil objects again uh, this first one is the default it does provide some materials and a couple of layers uh, the grease pencil blank provides nothing for you and that's what people want they want to stop deleting this squiggly line stop deleting these default colors because you don't need them now if you do need them the grease pencil stroke that you create in the add button does provide these remember the default one does not provide a green or a blue or even a solid color they they just provide this these two dotted lines this gray one and then the the grease pencil monkey provides all the stuff that you need to illustrate this monkey. In fact, the illustration is already there. Um, it just provides with all the stuff that you need if we select it for that monkey. Hey guys, I hope that this was a little bit uh, helpful to you. If you liked the video, guys, go ahead and uh, click on the like button and subscribe, and I will see you on the next one. Thank you, guys.